Hallelujah, glory to God. This is Prophetic Intercession with Amel. You are welcome. Always a privilege to come your way with a prophetic message. If this is the first time you're seeing me or the first time you're coming across my channel, God bless you. Thank you so much for stopping by. I pray that God will use this channel to minister to you. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. This person has, has evil intentions against you, but God is changing it. This person has an evil plan for you. They are planning to hurt you. They are planning to harm you. But God is changing it. When the Lord gave me this prophetic word, two scenarios came to my mind. The first one were the wise men. You know, the wise men didn't set out initially to bless Jesus. No, they did not set out to come and give him gifts. No. The wise men are people who studied the stars. And they were people who could, you know, um, how do they say it? They could, you know, they could steal your luck just from identifying your star and they realized that that star was not they were trying to steal the lock of jesus and they realized that it was not a usual star it was an abnormal star and so they set out to see the person that had a kind of a star that could not be stolen and so they realized it was jesus and instead they blessed him with gifts instead of stealing his star they set out to steal his star but instead of stealing the star they ended up blessing him blessing him because God changed it. The same thing happened for Bal um, between Balak and Balaam. Balak paid Balaam to, to curse the children of God. And when he opened his mouth to, mouth to curse, what was coming out of it were blessings. Because God changed it. The intentions were to hurt, him, to hurt the people of God. But God changed it and instead blessed them. God says that somebody has an evil intention towards you. They are so much planning to hurt you. But God is turning it around. God is changing it. In the mighty name of Jesus. That is why I love the Lord. He's got the power in his hands to change the hearts of men. The Bible says that the hearts of kings is in the hands of the Lord. And he turns it whatever way he chooses. And right now he is changing this person's heart. Instead of hurting you, they will bless you. Hallelujah. May the Lord bless you, keep you, cause his face to shine upon you. May he be gracious to you and give you peace. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen.